In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to play local mp3 files on your iPad. Now this is very simple. I'll show you two methods of doing this. One is using VLC Media Player, which is a third party tool. And also you can use Spotify, which is also a very commonly used third party music playing app. So let me start with VLC because it's a whole separate app. So you can go to the Apple App Store and find an app called VLC Media Player. So it's a free app and uh, it's a very good and trustworthy application. I've been using it for years on my computers, on my Android phone, on my iPhone. I use it all the time. So just go ahead and install this app, the VLC Media Player. And then when you launch the app, you'll notice it will not have access immediately to your uh, mp3 files or any music you have stored in the files app of your iPhone or iPad. So what you want to do is go to the files app. Now this tutorial is on an iPad, but it also works on the iPhone as well. So go to the files app and then find your mp3 file or mp3 files. So I have on my iPad here, if I go to the downloads folder and try to find an mp3 file, so this is an example of an mp3 file. Now you can have multiple mp3 files. So for instance, if you have songs in a folder, it doesn't really matter. So this one is an individual file, but like I said, it could be in a folder. So copy that mp3 file or folder. So long press on it and then select either copy or move. Now, if you're limited in terms of storage space, then you can always go ahead and select move. But if you still want to retain a copy in the downloads folder, you can go ahead and copy. So for me, I'll just select move and then I'll choose to move into on my iPad that goes into your iPad's storage location. And then you want to look for a folder called VLC because as soon as you install VLC media player, it's going to create a folder in your iPhone or in your iPad. So go to that folder and then you want to paste that item there. So long press an empty space and then select paste. So that's going to paste the mp3 file or mp3 folder containing mp3 files. Now once that is pasted there and you tap on move to confirm, then it should be good to go. Okay. Now just to confirm, you can go back to on my iPad and then go to VLC media player and you can see our mp3 file is here or folder. So now when you open VLC media player, you'll notice that particular uh, MP3 file is now available in VLC media player and you can play it straight from here. So that is basically how to do that. Now, if you had a whole folder with MP3 files or songs, you can just uh, move them to these uh, VLC folder and you can access them all of them from the VLC media player. So that's one way to do that. Now, let me also show you how to do this with Spotify. So a lot of people have Spotify and if you don't want to install VLC, you can even use Spotify. So it's the same trick in Spotify. You can also copy any MP3 file and then look for the Spotify folder. So let's go to on my iPad and try to find the folder for Spotify. If you can't find it, then that means you've not enabled the option in the Spotify app. So first of all, go to Spotify, tap on your profile icon and then select settings and privacy. Under settings and privacy, scroll down to local files, tap on that and you want to enable the option for local files. So enable that and then confirm you want to allow. So Spotify would like to access Apple Music, your music and video activity and your media library. So just tap on allow. And then of course, uh, you can allow that. And then once you do that, if you now go to the files up, there should be a folder called Spotify. So now you can go ahead and paste any MP3 file or folder containing MP3 files into the Spotify folder. Once you do that, now you can go back to Spotify and then go to your library and then you should see a new 
a library called local files so you can tap on that and then you can play the locally saved music directly in spotify so that is basically how to play local mp3 files on your iphone or ipad thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck